Okay, so I'm, meet, I'm supposed to meet Telsia or Clea. Ah. Uh, Telsia or Clea? Hmm. I don't know. Clea's got an evil brother and the mom's... Uh, I don't want all that drama, to be honest with you. Telsia, I kind of broke up with her, but uh, she seems quite keen, so... Damn it! Hello? Hello? Okay, well, where would Telsia be? Uh... Lounge, maybe? Let's see. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Good guess. Hi, Telsia. What's up? Glad you made it. You've hey. been very busy lately. Yeah, I've had a lot of research. With the Idril woman. You sound jealous. You sound afraid. Afraid? Of what? Of us. Look, I realize we haven't had a lot of time to reconnect since I've been on the Enterprise. Mm -hmm. It's not that. It, it's the Dallas. The Dallas? When I walked onto that death ship and saw the bodies, and when I learned you didn't make it to the safety of the station... What? Tells you... I thought you were dead. We risk death together all the time in the Delta Quadrant. But I never saw you dead. That's so hard to take? Me appearing dead? No. You being alive. Explain that. Telsia, I am so grateful that you're alive that I can't even think about losing you again. Oh. Oh, okay. So I don't get... Any choices in this regard? Hello? It's a terrible lesson. The Exomorphs turning on their masters. Indeed. Hello. Do you want to get it on? Thing you convince Crindo to help us. I don't think Sid would have made it much longer. I think there's something wrong with your mouth. I'm glad that I had enough supplies on board the ship. That was too close for comfort. Hmm, indeed. Okay. <sighs> Do I go back to the shuttle bay now? Or what? Lieutenant Monroe, I have a new toy. Ah, oh, crap. Damn it. Decade Armory. This fucking guy with his stupid guns and training and stuff. I mean, I'm, I'm probably near the end of the game, right? Now I'm still doing, like, holodeck training crap. What's going on here? Where's the armory? E. Okay, make a left. Left, other left. What's up, man? What do you want from me? Hello? We've replaced a photon burst with a quantum burst weapon. Okay. It uses micro quantum torpedoes. Okay. We can test it in the new holo program. I don't want to. <sighs> so, it's a rocket launcher. Right, Corban, you make a rocket launcher. That's quite nice for you. It's not even a very good one because the splash damage sucks. Thank you, Corban. That was an incredible waste of my time. Almost as good as a Klingon. Bar Barkley to Monroe. We're finished. Bar Bar Barkley to Monroe. Okay, great. Proceed to Shuttle Bay 1. Fantastic. Deck 7, Shuttle Bay. Freaking mini levels. It's all Half-Life's fault. <sighs> Sorry, guys. I know I'm kind of annoyed today. Um... Yeah, it just, it happens, you know. Hello. Are we ready to go? 
Can we go now? Omag is on the starbase. He's mm -hmm. agreed to meet Crindo. Okay. Take Crindo's shuttle to the meeting. We're keeping the Enterprise out of range of the starbase's sensors, so you'll be on your own. Okay. I'm ready. And in about 15 seconds from now, it's going to be loading again. Or maybe even less than 15. Oh, it's um, like sooner than that. See, load and then, like, cutscene and then load. And then. Uh. Keep the engines hot, Sydney. We may have to leave in a hurry. You got it. Keep your weapons out of sight unless we need to defend ourselves. Hopefully, Omag will come quietly. Okay, Crindo. Let's go to the bar. Yeah, let's go get this dumb bitch. Do we know do we know what it looks like? Crap. This old star base is in better days. I hear that the Ferengi Indeed. This must be the bar. Okay. Excellent. I'm the commander of the transport vessel Kaitan. My uh, friend here tells me you're looking for transportation. Yes, indeed. If it's a the VIP vessel, lounge is locked. Vessel? Only the bar. The Kaitan is a Wudan class transport vessel. Okay. Hello. You know. How much to get into the VIP room? <laughs> you have to prove your worth. You'll have to beat our Nosikin friend in melee combat. Melee combat. Okay. Cool. Let's do that then. You dare trifle with me, Federation? Die. Alright. Get him, Monroe! This is exciting melee combat. Oh yeah, I just run in, I just strafe in circles and smack him with a one kind of attack. This is epic. <laughs> oh, the people didn't like that I won. That's nice. That's gonna be very <sighs> comfortable. Here's the code to the VIP room. Come back when you want a job as a bouncer. <laughs> I'm telling you, that guy is Ardrek Luxor. Now, why would a famous rising musician be here? <laughs> there he is. Walk over to him without looking back at us. Ah, Crindo. Sit down, my friend. Where did you find this new master control facility? Where'd you find the old one? Goodbye. Sit down, Omeg. Let's keep this friendly. Friendly? The bigger the smile, the sharper the knife. Ferengi rules of acquisition number 48. Sorry. Damn, that popping is Never terrible. Of this master control facility. Rule 60. Keep your lies consistent. All right. You caught me in an inconsistency. So here's the truth. I don't know where the master control facility is. Rule 85. Never let the competition know what you're thinking. I don't intend to. And I've never heard of your master control facility. You lying Ferengi! Tell the truth. And they accuse you of lying. Just like Rule 285. No good deed ever goes unpunished. <sighs> you.
you're telling the truth, there's nothing more dangerous than an honest businessman. Rule 27. <laughs> then I'm too dangerous for you, because I'm telling the truth. How do we know you're telling the truth? Okay. Rule 181 says not even dishonesty can tarnish the shine of profit. Because I don't want to know where it is. If I knew the location of the master control facility, my customer would be afraid I'd sell it again. Why give him incentive to kill me? No! I merely sold Crindo's data from those old ruins and let my customer fiddle about with those star charts to actually find it. But I gave you false data. False data? Now who's the liar? Of course I lied. I'm too smart to trust you. But dumb enough to trust the shuttle I gave you. Rule 99. Trust is the biggest liability of all. Your shuttle transmitted all the real data to me. <laughs> you son of a... Rule 31. Never make fun of a Ferengi's mother. Insult something he cares about instead. I'll kill you. No, you won't. Omag, give us the name of your customer and you can go. Rule 76. Every once in a while, declare peace. But war is good for business. Rule 34. And here's another rule. Let's you and him fight. Latinum for Federation heads! Oh, great. No one have to chase him, right? Gonzalez, stay here with Crindo. Mm. Aye, sir. Ow, what is that? Oh boy. Can I just chase him or do I have to fight these guys or I don't know. Jeez, this guy's got a lot of helpers, eh? Almost jumped over. Okay, I really need some health right now. Like seriously. Damn, that was that was pretty bad. Me and my stupid phaser. Okay, open. Oh, I have to press the button every single time. Press the button, press the button. Why couldn't they just have like little motion sensors or something? 